Welcome to Aurora, the incubator of World 2.0. My name's Jay Skell, and we've been expecting you. You've been invited here to innovate, to invent, and to create. But we're also asking you to do the most important thing with your lives that you can do. Here, away from the rest of the world, we will build the tools to lead the planet into the future a completely sustainable economy, a blossoming environment, safe homes, security for your family, and a community where innovation is celebrated. The generations that come after us may forget all about us, but they will thrive because of the work we do here. Thank you for joining Skeltech in a war. Together, we are building tomorrow. All right, y'all, welcome back. Can I heal myself? Yeah, I can. Hold on. It's actually pretty cool. It has its own animation. All right, looks like we're all set. What is it? Oh my god, did you guys see that? <laughs> my guy dives in it. It's a big jump. Okay. 
X. Alright, you got it. Oh, it looks like we got bad guys here. I'm, I'm gonna be needing that. <laughs> Those medic. There's two over there. I'm gonna go from the back. Oh shit. Yo. <laughs> So he just threw a grenade. <laughs> nah. Did you see me? No. Oh no, I can't see him. There we go. Alright, let's check if there was anybody in there. <laughs> oh. Is that one of ours? No, nah, she got shot. Last thing I want somebody to pop right in front of me. Hold on. A grenade or what? Oh, okay. Right, what? Shit. My soldiers. You okay, buddy? Yeah, that guy was gone. I think it's a 30 or 32 ghosts. Right here. I actually want to use the, the pistol because I'm not sure if... Uh, it looks like the, the other one has a suppressor, but... I don't know if, it <laughs> if it'll still be loud. Wondering where am I at? These guys are the biggest badasses the US government has. Our defenses took them out like it was nothing. Sure about that? Damn, I missed. There you go. Nobody heard that, right? Actually, it sounds like <laughs> his stomach right there. We are summoning. Oh, how nice. Nobody here? No, oh, looks like they're living. How the hell are we supposed to find anyone in this? 
type of machines that they build here? They must be huge. Oh. What happened? We'll do it again. Those games are trash. Nothing walks away from something like that. Just stay alert, man. I don't want to be the guy that misses a survivor and gets us in trouble. Do a sweep of an area this big. This place is huge. I like this gun. <laughs> it's a bit loud, though. <clears throat> kind of want a sniper, though. There's gotta be somebody. Alive, hopefully. I ain't trying to be alone. Storm Cloud 1 1, this is Weaver, come in, over! This is Weaver, come in, over! Anything? Who got? Contact, contact! Walker, a hundred. What the hell are you doing? Should we try it? I'm gonna try it. <laughs> I actually want to try it. See <laughs> if we can survive this. All right. So these guys are level hundred. I'm bringing level one or two, so see how this plays out. <laughs> Nothing in this area. Raj, quiet here too. Okay, <laughs> headshots work. I see him, I see him, I see him. Got him, got him, got him, got him. I was way too close. Mm, looks like there's one more this way. Oh, it's two. Okay. It's two. That's actually pretty easy. For level 100? What we got? Oh, okay. Well, it was worth it. Just got myself some pergolos right there. Okay, you know what, I actually want to go loud, yeah let's go loud, sure about that, that's two,
go. There we go. Thank you for trying though. Nice fight, nice fight. Oh wait, hold on. What we got? DMR. I was gonna check the seat. <laughs> Mayday. Oh, the radio. Mayday. This is Ghost Lead. Does anyone read? Five by five, Ghost Lead. Who is this? A friend. I got the radio from a ghost. This ghost still breathing. Ghost Lead, you can chase the white rabbit. Or run with the Red Queen. Give me a sit rep. That can wait. Your man's getting medical treatment. Follow the trail behind the ancient ruins. Your destination is in the mountains between two waterfalls. Understood. Go sleep out. Alright, looks like some of them made it. Let's shot this gun. I actually want to try to see what's up. I'm gonna try a different way this time. This gun is actually pretty good. Oh, we got some pants. All right. I have to go for the motorcycle. I'm sorry. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, hop a wheelie. Wait. Did y'all see that? Oh. What's this? Oh, it has a bear on it. Credits, alright. I should have parked the more closer. <laughs> hey, a willy. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> yeah, I should pay attention where the road now. Shit. It won't last long. Yep. Man, that glare, what was that? <laughs> like, I know it was the sun, but what? Holy shit, what is that? Looks sick. I actually kind of want to try it. 
Uh, hold on. Yeah, mine's oh, mine's twelve though. Range is good though. I think I'll keep it. This though, we're gonna go for sharpshooter. Oh, parachute. All right. Night vision, yes, please. Twenty percent, yes. I wish you can do all that. Well, this bike is pretty slow. <laughs> Check out the helicopter. Oh, in there, okay. What's the password? Uh, I don't know. Open sesame. Stop right there! Who are you? I was invited. Who the hell are you? Another one. You can always turn around and go back down the mountain. Things are a little tense, you know? Just watch how you handle that weapon. We don't allow shooting in Erewhon. And what's Erewhon? A cave. That's what we call it. Bruh. <laughs> Get in. That's it? No. Okay, cool. Oh, that's a player. Oh. <laughs> thought, I, thought it was one of my guys. What's wrong what with you? What is this here? place? You're a white... Damn, man. You're stressed out. Big time. It's actually pretty cool though. It's like a safe haven. Are you boys alright or what? We're the only two left in our chalk. No radio, no drones. Between the two of us, we got two rifles and eight mags. Locals got water here. And some supplies. Can you believe this place, man? God damn. My mind's blown. Yep. I'm there for any more or less, but they're still keeping us on a short leash. Can imagine. You boys know what took out our birds? No clue, but there are definitely hostiles out there. Tangled with some troops out there who are calling themselves wolves. You know who we're dealing with? Now you're dealing with me. No, it's the white haired guy. You the one in charge here? Who's asking? My call sign's Nomad. I'm the officer in charge of this operation. By operation, I assume you mean the massively wild screw up. Hey, old man. You playing nice? I'm just trying to find out why a bunch of grunts are falling from the sky into our laps, honey. Well, someone sank a naval cargo ship off the coast. Then the entire archipelago of Aroll went dark. Now, we were sent here to figure out what happened. Next thing we know, the choppers were taken down. 
Almost half of my soldiers are dead. Best we can tell, there's some kind of military takeover. Sentinel, military contractors, they put this place under martial law, using the old boot in the neck technique to enforce it. Skeltech is still making all the high tech stuff they always make. Except maybe now they're making more weapons. Not exactly the libertarian utopia J. Skell advertised. Where can I find J. Skell? Ah, uh, the head of Skeltech himself. Mm. We haven't seen him, but his drones are keeping an eye on his islands. So you think he's still a part of this? We're just not sure why. All right. Well, I'll put figuring it out on my to do list. For now, I see our wounded. Yeah. One of your guys needs to rest, but he won't shut up. Calm him down, yeah? And then come find me. I'll give you the guided tour. Check that out. SC 20K. <laughs> that guy went for full tattoos, man. <laughs> you heard from Samuel? Not since last week. Greetings. Uh, couldn't help but over here. There's some kind of problem. We're not sure. Our friend Samuel's missing. You a homesteader? Yeah, used to be. Before he decided he'd rather live by himself. No great loss, if you ask me. He likes catching his own food. Says it keeps him closer to nature or something like that. And then he gives the furs and leftover meat to the camp. Never takes anything in return. I don't get it. Sounds like he knows how to take care of himself. Last week, he was down here hollering about running into a bunch of sentinels on his land. They said they carried away a couple of deer he caught, smashed up his traps, and then... This week? Nothing. Samuel's always had a temper, but... In this place, these days, you say the wrong thing to the wrong person, well, you know. Yeah, I know. Say, where are his usual stomping grounds? He's typically around to the southeast of Garden Mangrove, northeastern part of Gairam. I'll see if I can find him. Thanks. Thanks for having my back. Oh, there we are. <laughs> I intentionally went the wrong way. So is the broadcast having any effect? Group of outcasts saved my ass out there. Might be a good idea to join forces. One wounded down, man. It's the only thing we got. left who made it hey, you just relax pal I'm doing what I can you damn superhero <sighs> here here's another superpower Can't find Midas. But Weaver. Hey, you just relax, pal. We'll take care of it, all right? And the wasp. Yeah. And with the comms blackout, I can't reach the ship. But I'll talk to Mad Shells, the big guy. You might have a boat I can use. Don't you worry. I'll come back with some help. Go. Oh, I got a drone. There's no freedom on Aroa anymore. You, you, you can't go 
walk in nature unescorted without being called a terrorist. They killed the dream of a free island. No, 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 no. It's worse than that. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> By definition, if we exist outside their system, we're terrorists, even if we're peaceful. Yeah, they don't want it. mission here has been hard. So many lost. So many suffering. My closest allies. My brothers. Cut down by a man we once trusted. But we are ghosts. Alone, we are formidable. Together, Others have survived here, and I have found the deadliest. As a team, we will take the fight to our enemies. We will avenge our fallen. Because we are ghosts. Available at any point after you have reached Erewhon for the first time, Fury, Fixit, and Vasily can be activated or dismissed at will. And from the beginning, you will be able to fully customize them. Oh, so. This customization includes all of the physical attributes, as well as gear, equipment, or even full costumes. Your teammates can be tweaked just as much as your main character, and they will always follow your own behavior. If you decide to go stealth, they will equip silencers and crouch, or go prone when possible. But if you decide to go loud and open fire, they will stick by your side. When deployed, you can issue different orders to your teammates through the order wheel. There are four different orders you can give to your teammates. You can tell them to regroup on your location, to hold their current position, to go to a specific location, and to open fire on nearby enemies. These orders can be given at any time, even through your binoculars and drone. Once they approach potential threats, the teammates will notify you and mark them automatically. I've got a hostile. With a good look at your enemies, you will be able to set up a sync shot where each of your teammates picks a target. You can even link it to your three sync shot drones for a simultaneous seven target takedown. The teammates have weapons equipped at all times, a versatile assault rifle to accommodate all situations, and a primary weapon that you will be able to fine tune. Indeed, apart from mark upgrades and passive bonuses, the full gunsmith is accessible to your teammates, and their weapon of choice will have a direct effect on the battleground. Depending on the type of weapon they have equipped, the teammates will adapt their engagement distance and rate of fire. From close distance shotgun wielding, all the way to long-distance sniper shots. Of course, if you get taken down, your teammates' priority will be to try and rescue you. To achieve that, they will first focus their fire on the surrounding enemies before getting to you. And they will expect the same from you, especially as you will be able to carry them to safety if the situation requires it. We'll see you on the battlefield, ghosts. 
<laughs> Not bad. She got me excited. <laughs> What's on the other side of all this? Uh, no, no, I have not. But now I will. <laughs> now I will. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold, my dude. How are you? How's it going? I'm good. But li listen, I need to show you something. Over there on the table. Recognize him? No. Yeah, his name is Victor Cost. Oh. He's old school black ops. My guess is he's here with the CIA. Well, if he's a mole, then he might be able to help us. From what I can tell, his location is somewhere near the channels. You might want to start by looking there. All right, I'll head over and see what I can dig up. This was a good find. Glad I can help. Even if I am all dinged up. Alright y'all. I think I'm gonna end it here. Uh so let's take care of the video on Deep State episode two. Okay, cool. Oh look at the map. It's actually pretty good. You know the first one on Wildlands had uh the predator? And um hopefully they have some yeah, this thing's big. Hopefully they have something like that. Oh we're right in the middle. Oh nice. But yeah, I think I'll end it here. Sick for the video. No, everyone's gone. Because I've enjoyed it. See you later.